What's up guys, it's your girl Carmen Chris and I'm back with another video. So today is the day. Today is surgery day. I'm so excited. I'm a little nervous, but I'm more so excited. Oh, did you see my cameo earlier? <laughs> yeah, so we're on our way to this surgery center right now. Um, Cherry's gonna be vlogging for me. So we're gonna try to get as much footage as we can. And we're gonna get footage of me coming home as well. So just stay tuned. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. My name is Linda. And you are Kristen? Yes. Okay, you don't have to sign okay. And they don't have bathrooms. Alright, do that. Mm -hmm. Wow, you got a lot of people here, huh? Yeah. Oh, we're filming it too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, okay. Um, there you go. What this is, is you just need to tell me who's with you today okay. and their phone number. Okay. okay? Don't, uh, don't put my government name on there. I can't let people know. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> right here, this is a consent for anesthesia. Dr. Nelson is our anesthesiologist, and he will take care of you, too. All right? And this is Amy, and Amy is your nurse that's going to take care of you. Don't forget this. Okay? I'm How are you? All right. You have to break anything? Good for you. Who's the little baby? That's my son. Oh, how sweet. Okay, and... Oh, he's cute. Thank uh, you. <laughs> you okay? He thought we were coming here for him, so he's kind of freaking oh, out. Oh, right. right. No, I'm not. <laughs> Mom. Not, not today. <laughs> okay. All right. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish getting your chart um, together. Mm -hmm. Amy will be taking you back shortly. Okay. All right? Thank you. It's okay, baby. Hi. Hi. Come on. Oh. That's all right, man. He didn't want to come back. Uh, no asthma. No. No medical problems, you? No. Can you take any medicines at all? No. You look good. <laughs> I'm just going to give you a couple medicines to prepare you. One's going to grab your mouth. And the other one's going to present any nausea and vomit. I already gave it to her. You did? Oh. Yep, and here's the gabapentin and the Tylenol. Just with a few sips of this water, you can take that. Okay. All right, so we've been in for an hour. <laughs> Let's zoom in so y'all can see how <laughs> extremely dry. God, I have extreme cotton mouth. Here. Oh. Some Vaseline. Ooh, this got cocoa butter in here. I only use it for my lips too. People are like, you got some Vaseline? No, I'm sorry. You got some chapstick? I don't. I'm not putting your nasty grubby hands in my little container. Oh, baby. This smells good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> All right. Almost time. I'm so thirsty. I want some water. You're gonna be like, do, do you guys mind if I just prop this camera up? Like from 360? Yeah. All right, just got marked up. No, I think I'm ready. You ready? I'm not nervous like I thought I was gonna be. Okay. Just give me a few seconds. Okay, thank you. All right. Yes. Just a few more minutes. I'm gonna give you a little medicine kind of reaction now and then we'll take you in in about five minutes or so. Okay. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> all right, all marked up. Ready to go. Get some advantages because we are young and we are black. Oh, yeah, that's what you said. Oh. You said, let's get it. 
elastic because I'm young and I'm black. I'm thirsty. <laughs> Your mouth is so dry because it's funny because you're licking your lips and nothing is happening. <laughs> nothing at all. See you later. Yeah, I will. Alright, so a couple hours post post up. It's okay. The good drugs. You have to sit up more. You turning, baby. You're not sitting up. Okay, you got it. You want more? Uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know what that means. Oh, he's kicking. Oh, this is gold. Look at you, Grandma. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <She's walking laughs> like Although she was walking like a grandma. Mm -hmm. Yes. She looked she looked Why is your arm shaking? Are you nervous? Is she hurt? That hurts. So you see the poop things right here? Yeah. It hurts there. So even oh, so. <laughs> It's temporary. It's okay, yeah. Mama. We're almost out of here. Lift up, up, up. There you go. You want a warm blanket? Somebody Absolutely. Oh, okay. Troy, you stay with me, or are you going with her? Okay. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, Mama. We made it. Step up. Step up. All right, do you want a rail or you want the wall? You gotta pick one. It's the next day. Um, I look a mess. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, I was in a lot of pain yesterday. A lot of pain. Um, uh, yeah, when I woke up, um, all the pain hit me all at once. And my mom said that I took medicine at the hospital or at the um, surgery center, but I don't remember. I don't remember taking it. And they don't let you eat. I had to stop eating um, at midnight the night before, and I couldn't have anything to eat before surgery. So basically my pills were not kicking in because I didn't have any food in my system. Oh. <laughs> well, how do they work? It just wasn't kicking in. Yeah, it just hadn't kicked in yet. Because if they take a while, and they get... So she gave it to you at noon, but it took time. And they want liquid, they don't feel. Well, my pills took a long time to kick in. And the pain was unbearable 
and I couldn't even sit still in the car on my way home. And then I um, started having really bad chest pain. Um, and I would say maybe that lasted maybe two hours. And I was finally able to relax a little bit. Um, I'm a lot better now. Just really sore. Really sore. But it's like, it's bearable. Like, it's not bad. It's not horrible. Um, I feel like the medicine was making me nauseous, though. But they have me on anti-nausea medication and an antibiotic. So, yeah, I have to go in today for my follow-up appointment to get changed, get my garments changed. Um, but, yeah, this vlog is probably going to be all over the place because I'm kind of out of it. I've been, like, sleeping on and off. So, but I just wanted to come on here and give a little update. I haven't seen my body yet, so I'm sure it's really swollen, bruised up. Yeah, I guess I'll just try to record when we get um, to my appointment. Hey guys, so don't mind my parents, I'm crazy. Um, we are on our way to my post-op appointment. Um, I have to get my garment changed. Um, I've been kind of leaking, so we have a... Um, shower curtain over the seat <clears throat> I'll take the but um just taking you guys along with this just checking in I'm kind of still out of it guys so don't mind me <laughs> I'm trying to do my best with this vlogging but yeah I guess I'll just get back on the camera when we get there I have like a really bad headache right now. Mm. And I want it to go away. Um, <coughs> I want my voice to come back too. I don't know. My voice went out, but I'm just waiting. Waiting. I don't have earrings in. Mm. I just feel nauseous. Yeah. The tighter this is, the better, okay? Especially when you're moving around. Unfortunately, this is all a standard size, and some people have smaller torsos than others. You have a small torso. <laughs> I have a long torso. So just try to like roll it up as best as you can and to keep this as flat as you can so it's not bunching up your stomach like you just seen. Okay. Okay? When you switch out to the next one, it's going to be better for you. Okay. Do you have any questions or anything? Um, we can have you sit up and slide that on. That way it'll be easier for you instead of doing it. Um, your antibiotic is a must. You have to finish that. Okay. The pain pills, if you're having pain, definitely take them. Don't torture yourself, but they're not essential. You don't have to finish the bottle, okay? But the antibiotic and showering every day is very, very important. Okay. All right? Your skin's going to be a little sensitive. You're going to go through, like, an itchy stage. Itching is healing, so just be careful with scratching and all that. Don't use any lotions or anything. Probably for, like, a good week while everything's healing, okay? Um... Do you have questions? I like I did and now I don't remember. <laughs> it's okay, and, th and that, that's usually is normal. Focus. Hey y'all, so. Oh, mess right now and I don't even know if I'm gonna add this to the video but today is oh look like really focus focus okay today is my first day alone 
my surgery was Monday. I'm sorry y'all, it's really dark in here because I've been having migraines, so I kind of been keeping it a little dark. But um, yeah, so my surgery was Monday. It is now Sunday. My mom left this morning. Um, and it's my first day alone. I'm looking crazy. I got like, I'm looking crazy, y'all. Like, look at my hair. Whatever. Um, I was, I'm a little nervous being here alone for the first time. Troy isn't here. He's with his dad because I still need to recover. And I didn't want to have him by myself yet. Um, I just made me some soup. But I've been able to walk around a little bit more. Um, I did go out Friday and Saturday. Spent some time with my family. Went to a baby shower yesterday. Um, I still am walking like really, really slow. Taking my time. I'm supposed to go back to work tomorrow. But I don't know. I'm going to try. I'm a little nervous to drive. Because riding in a car is painful right now any little bump is really painful um so i'm gonna try to get up and and get myself together and make it to work tomorrow but if i'm just not feeling up to it while i'm there I, i'm just gonna have to leave because i do have stitches in my back um and at the top of my butt so it's very uncomfortable for me to just sit in a chair all day so I don't know and I've been getting migraines I've been having migraines for like four or five days straight right now and um, I have to look at a computer screen all day and that with a migraine is not I don't know if I'm up to being productive yet <sighs> so I feel like taking off work for about two weeks is actually a good idea if you ever get this procedure um, if you have a job that's just like sitting down or whatever an office job I should say but um I don't know I'm gonna try to go in tomorrow but if I'm not feeling up to it then I will be back home because I'm still sore I'm not in as much pain as I was before but it is still sore I can't sit certain ways like I can't sit for a long period of time so I don't know but I just wanted to get up, get on here and, and give you guys an update on how I'm doing. Um, yeah, so it's my first day alone. And I really don't like it. I don't want to be alone right now. Um, not that I can't be alone, but just a little nervous and not being able to really do things how I want to do them. Like, I'm able to wash myself and everything now, but... I'm still very sore. I still can't move certain ways. It still takes me a long time to do things. So I don't know. I just would rather have someone here with me. So I might just have like a family member come stay with me this week or something. Because I do get Troy back on Wednesday. So I'm a little nervous about that because I can't lift anything over 10 pounds. It's like how am I supposed to bathe him and really attend to him? alone so i don't know but i just want to check in with you guys and let you know how i was doing <laughs> 